Hey Aquarius. So this is going to be your end of December reading. Of course this reading can resonate with you at any time. So the energy I was getting for you guys or the phrase I was getting for you guys is next level. So you could want to take a relationship to the next level, a business, schooling, whatever, to the next level. We do have the High Priestess, the Lover's card, and the Strength. So, but like, a lover could be coming into your life. I'm also getting with this High Priestess here. You could feel a connection with someone and uh, you know that they feel this way about you. Even if they haven't said anything, the High Priestess is like, your intuition is telling you that this person feels some way about you or vice versa. You could be dealing with a Pisces, a Leo, or a Gemini. We do have the Sun card here, so I do feel like um it's going to be revealed we do have the hanged man so this is like stagnancy i do feel like there's a lot of stagnancy in your love life somebody could be going through some sort of situation it could be you guys we have the three of swords here this is heartbreak this is um betrayal this could be the person that you're dealing with or both but i feel like it would the high priestess be the very first card with the lovers your intuition is telling you that somebody feels some like of feelings for you and they're just not expressing it this person could be shy or scared to express it the eight of swords is like holding yourself back or this could be you not wanting to express how you feel to this person keeping things stagnant so, what is the energy surrounding aquarius some card here things are going to be revealed we do have temperance so somebody's healing or somebody could have healed from a situation be dealing with a Sagittarius. Okay. The Empress. Yeah, this is a new beginning. Can be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra as well. Somebody wants a new beginning. Most of getting somebody could see you as the Empress. With the Sun and the Empress here, a lot of abundance could be coming um, your guys' way. But this feels very much so like love or some sort of connection. There's not any pinnacles here. You have the Two of Swords with the Ace of Wands. Somebody is trying to make a decision on if they want to give you clarity about how they feel. We do have the Justice card here with the Ace of Wands. Somebody wants to give you clarity about how they feel, but they're not sure. It's like, I just think they're not doing it because they're not sure how things are going to turn out. Like, they have no idea. Both of these cards, these people are blindfolded. They don't know how it's going to turn out. They don't know how you're going to react. So they're just not. It's like they're, they're keeping their self-distance because they're shy. Or just kind of scared of the outcome if it doesn't go well about the high priestess but it's like even though this person is not revealing how they feel to you you already know so yeah we have the two of pentacles here you don't know what to do about this situation clarify the letters i'm also getting that if you guys have gone through some sort of situation if this is like an ex or someone that you're dealing with currently you it's like, you know what your intuition is telling you, but it's like, you don't know what to do with that information. We have the Page of Pentacles here. This person, for one, they're moving very slow. I'm also getting that they're, I don't know, it's like they're reflecting back on the past, but this could be you reflecting back on the past, or this could be someone that you have recently dealt with. Oh, so they're scared of a reaction. Or, like, rejection, possibly, from you. Clarify the strength card. The magician, yeah. I feel like this person's going to... I just feel like they're going to reveal. They're going to get the strength and be brave enough to tell you how they feel. But, like, until then, shit's just stagnant between you two. I feel like love life in general could be stagnant. We do have the tower here. Surprising news. I feel like it's from this person. Them finally expressing. You may not have talked to this person for a while. And it's like all of a sudden they open up to you. Where's the sun? Let that card go. Where's the sun card here? Oh, the ten of cups. Yeah, someone's gonna tell you that you make them very happy. But there's like conflict around the situation. But there's like conflict around the situation. Okay. So things are stagnant for a reason. This person is definitely going through something. Someone could be dealing with a liar, a cheater, 
of the five of swords with the five of swords and the seven of swords it's like this person is being very sneaky about their approach with you i don't feel like maybe it could be like they're lying to you i'm also getting that they could have lied like and told you that they didn't feel anything for you but they lied and they could be expressing this or this could be you guys they're the queen of um, earth in reverse so it's like maybe back then they didn't see your value this feels yeah Page of Pentacles is like they're reflecting on the past. They didn't see your value before. Clarify the Eight of Swords. This could be why they are pretty much holding themselves back from expressing how, like expressing how they feel about you, because like they had a chance, but they did not see your value. So yeah, clarifying the Eight of Swords is the hanged man. They're keeping shit stagnant because they're scared to approach you. And I really feel like it's because they could have rejected you in the past. You could have rejected them in the past. Whatever. Okay. So yeah, you guys could definitely be in a relationship with a Sagittarius or getting, um, can be getting some communication from a Sagittarius. Yeah, this person wants to heal the connection. Even if this is just a friendship, they want to heal the connection. It feels romantic because we have the lover's card, the two of cups. Could be dealing with a Leo as well. Clarify the Empress. I'm also getting Taurus. Clarify the Empress. Okay. Yeah, Three of Pentacles. This is crazy because it's like before they saw you as the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Now they see you as the Empress and want to work things out with the Three of Pentacles. So this could be you not sure what to do. You don't know what to do because it's like you're the Empress. You can have whoever the fuck you want. You could be focusing on business, focusing on work. And I think they're, they could be a little bit hesitant to even express how they feel because they know you're in that energy. Clarify the two of swords. Okay, hello. Too many. Clarify the two of swords. Yeah, we have the Tower and the Ten of Pentacles. It's almost like you could have surprised them that I don't know, a lot of abundance could be around you with this Ten of Pentacles and the Empress. So you, like, they're surprised by what you can do, by what you can accomplish, what you have accomplished. Like with this Tower here, I'm kind of getting mind blown. And with this, it's almost like the Seven of Swords. They could have been lying to themselves. All this can be vice versa, but somebody lied to themselves. Or somebody could have lied to them about you. This is why they're so surprised. So the advice. We, oh, okay. So the advice we have the Empress and the Knight of Cups. For some reason with these two cards, I'm getting hear them out. Don't necessarily take them back if you guys don't feel that's the right thing to do. But I feel and hear them out. This could be an ex or this could, could just be an old love interest. But... We have the Empress card here, so it's almost like continue to focus on what you're growing. Because there's a lot of abundance coming your way where you could have a lot of abundance. I feel like if you do have a lot of abundance, more is coming your way. Anyway, what is the advice? I'm also getting with this Knight of Cups. Express how you feel about the situation. Okay. Yeah, we have the Page of Pentacles in the reverse. So it's like express how you feel to them. And then it's almost like kind of leave it in your past. We have the emperor here, so there could be somebody that um, <clears throat> is maybe better suited for you. The emperor and the empress coming your way as well. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, guys, I've been sick like all week. Uh, what is advice for Aquarius? Page of Swords. Yeah, this is saying, for one, the situation has ended or it's going to end. This is the end of a cycle. But it's like, say what you need to say. Because there could be some things that you want to say to this person as well. But it's almost like leave this in the past. And a lot of you could be doing this anyway. But there's definitely a new person here for you. Somebody that's way better suited for you coming in. So, anyway. I hope this was a good reading for you. If you would like a personal reading, there's information down below on how you could get one. And enjoy the rest of your month.